just as a director, the thought, will the fans like this, goes through my head a million times a day. It's unfair. That's our railing? Yeah. That's the railing. That's the railing. Yeah. Kind of inspired by the railing in Snoke's throne room. It's kind of, but we made ours a little bit more geometric and angular. His are, they, they're, they're angular, but they're a little tad more feminine. Um, so we kind of made ours a little bit more cool. angular and aggressive looking. Yeah. And the whole motif of triangles for the empire. Yeah, and that's the window that they're gonna make bigger. No. Yeah. Yeah. It's a little small. Looks very Star Wars though. It does. That's for sure. Hopefully, even if we make it longer, I'd like it bigger this way. But I can I can deal with it if they make it longer. Yeah. It'd be better for just twice the size. You know? Yeah. I mean, if it were six feet tall instead of four feet, because it's about four feet right now. But if we're like six feet tall plus. 16 feet instead of 8 feet. Day two of the set construction. Uh, Ian has already got on me for uh, worrying about something on day, day three of shooting. <laughs> he's, already, he's already got on my case about worrying about uh, one particular scene and not this construction. So, but what this is what we're doing. I'll take you on a tour. A lot of noise, so hopefully you're gonna be able to hear what's going on. Um, platform for part of this set right here. It's about two feet high. There'll be stairs leading up to it. Uh, the walls are 12 feet. Um, it doesn't look like much now, but by the end of today, it'll look a lot better and it'll look like a set. So we're going to start putting the walls up and uh, fastening them down with like uh, supports. Um, and uh, yeah, that's pretty much it right for right now. We just gotta get to work. They're doing a good job. This fan film is not by Lucasfilm. I'm just a really big fan, so that's my disclaimer for my hat that I'm wearing. All right, the schedule for this week is as follows. We have two days of build, a third day, building the set that is, a third day of bleed over for the build to do all finishing touches, plus pre-rigging and lighting, so that's when our cinematographer Matt Holla comes in and we light the set, we test, the, all the fun toys and gadgets that I'm not gonna get into because it might be spoilers. Um, and then we shoot for four days. We shoot a day with, uh, day with Vader and Sidious. We shoot uh, another day with Vader and Sidious plus Padme and young Anakin. And then we'll shoot for four days. And those four days will be uh, Vader, Sidious, Padme, uh, clones, all the characters of this web series. So we'll be on, um, or of this first episode, rather. Uh, we'll be on stage for three days, and then we'll be on location in a big, giant mausoleum uh, that you've seen uh, for the fourth day. And, and so the stage shooting has its big advantages. It's a lot more controllable. You know where your power is coming from. You know where your lights are. You can set it up and just do it location shooting often looks more real because it's an actual practical location, uh, which our set's gonna be awesome, so don't need to worry about that. Um, but when you're on location, then you gotta deal with problems of where's your electricity coming from, uh, and a bunch of other little things. So that's, we're shooting for four days, three days of massive prep and build, in addition to, honestly, the months that have been leading up to this point. Shot lists are completed, uh, we've had plenty of production meetings. And so this is basically, A, when all the magic happens and where the money all starts really getting spent. What? So that's the next week.
So guys, I hope you are pumped because this is going to be like the coolest thing ever. I'm telling you, it's gonna be awesome. It's gonna be fun. We're having a lot of fun and we are really trying to make and pack this with as much action, story, emotion to really show you a Darth Vader that we want to explore and that we may have not seen as much in depth as we're used to in the films. Um, and it's gonna be a fantastic ride and we're really excited to have you here. And guys, I just wanna say, I promise you that the thought of, just as a director, the thought, will the fans like this, goes through my head a million times a day. Sometimes I'm like, I hope the fans like this. And the other times are like, the fans are gonna freaking be amazed by this because it's awesome. Um, so we're making this for you. We want you to love it. And I think truly, you're gonna love it. So don't do anything I wouldn't do twice and you'll be just fine. Hope you guys enjoyed the quick little update. I left a lot of stuff out, which I'll add at the end of December when the fan film comes out. I gotta get to the studio right now. It's about a half hour drive or half hour Uber. So I gotta leave you guys with this video. I will see you all in the next episode of Star Wars Theory. Thanks for watching everyone. Until then, my fellow Jedi and Sith friends, remember the force be with you. Ooh.